To say that Manchester United's pursuit of Ivan Perisic this summer has been drawn out is the understatement of the century. But by the sounds of it, in the last 48 hours, there has been genuine progress in Man United's move for the Croatian winger. Sky Sports are reporting that Man United are making progress in this move for Ivan Perisic. The second point all summer long has been the valuation. Man United had a £39 million bid rejected for the 28-year-old because Inter were holding out for £48 million. But with Inter Milan closing in on a new signing, Lazio winger Kaito Balde, that is considered one of the big pushes for Man United's pursuit of Perisic because they wanted, or at least they inquired, about getting Anthony Martial as part of the deal. <laughs> That's never going to happen. Good luck. Move on. They've moved on to Kaito Balde from Lazio and they're closing in on the signing of him. So just like Timu Bakayoko to Chelsea is considered a sort of stepping stone in the right direction for Nemanja Matic to lead Chelsea, Kaito Balde arriving at Inter Milan is a major one in any departure this summer for Ivan Perisic. Now Perisic was given permission to leave Inter's training camp over the weekend where he flew back to his native Croatia because he had toothache. Now the cynic in me is looking at that and saying, toothache, that's got to be the world's worst excuse since I told my year eight teacher that my dog ate my homework. But maybe it's true, maybe he did have toothache and maybe there is a very special dentist in Croatia that deals with Perisic like nobody else in the world can. But maybe he just wanted to leave and sort out his future. Depends which way you look at it. But with Inter flying out to China for their pre-season tour on Tuesday, that is why now is considered a crucial 36-48 hours in the future of Ivan Perisic. Inter Milan will be keen to secure a deal for him before they leave. If he is going to go, Man United would want to secure a deal before he leaves so he can join out on the pre-season tour. And Perisic himself will want his future resolved so he can move on and move on with his football career, hopefully at Man United and not at Inter Milan. Now Sky Sports are not the only news outlet reporting this because Miguel Delaney from The Independent is also saying that Perisic to Man United is close. So are we finally about to see the 28 year old become Jose Mourinho's third summer signing behind Victor Lindelof and Romelu Lukaku? He might not be that first choice winger for everybody, but he's certainly going to be an upgrade on the current options we've got in the fact that he is a winger that goes on the outside he'll bring a different style of play to Man United. And we did become very predictable last year. Now, I've always said that I would prefer if we signed someone like Alexis Sanchez, who is ready-made for the Premier League, world-class and an absolute game-changer. But Sanchez cuts inside a little bit more than Perisic, who goes on the outside. And that's something that we've got to remember when it comes to transfers. Man United fans, you know, we see players and we see what they can do and how they can add and improve to our squad. Jose Mourinho scouts have done detailed scouting reports for months, looking at every single individual aspect of a player and how he will solve problems that Man United has. So I'd like to think that they know more than me. And if Mourinho does want Perisic, I will trust Mourinho's judgment and I will go and I will get behind that signing. Just like I did with Pogba, Mkhitaryan, all of, the, all of the signings we have made so far have worked out. And I hope that if we do sign Lindelof, that is going to be the case as well. But one thing everybody has got to get very clear in this situation is that Anthony Martial is not going anywhere. Anybody reporting Martial out, saying that Martial is going somewhere, completely bullshit. Martial is going nowhere this year. Maybe if he has another so-so season that doesn't really work out for him and he's on the bench a lot of the time, he's a little bit frustrated, then there might be some credence to these reports. But Martial's going nowhere. We saw it against LA Galaxy we saw a little bit of spark, a little bit of the old Martial coming back. He was shooting from everywhere. That was a bit ridiculous. But Martial is a player who is a game changer in this Man United squad. And Mourinho is not going to get rid of any of his game changers. So we might finally be getting towards the end of this transfer saga. We always get stuck in transfer sagas every single summer. It's Manchester United. We know it's going to happen. Doesn't make it any less painful and boring when it actually does happen though. But the general consensus here is that with Inter Milan flying out to China on Tuesday, they want to get something resolved and not let it drag out any more than it needs to. And that's certainly going to be the case for Mourinho and Perisic. But as always, do you think Perisic is that right signing? Do you trust Jose Mourinho's judgment? Or do you think he might be making a mistake in paying 35, 40, 45 million for the 28-year-old Croatian winger and the fact that he won't be a good signing for us? Let me know what you think in the comments below. As always, drop a like on the video, ladies and gents. 
We'll see you soon. Take it easy.